on, ladies and gentlemen? It is your man's Mr. Dominic Cruz, featured on ABC, NBC, CBS, Yahoo, and Fox, coming at you with another video. Yes, another one, another one. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and notification bell so every time I make a video, you be the first one to know. So let's get into this whole thing because... You know, I, I've and a lot of people are taking advantage of this free coaching for the Black November sale that I have going on. It's free coaching. So it's in the description box. You can click and schedule a call with me. So here's the thing. A lot of women, right? There, there's very, very few women that have a good man. And you know what? But that's not... For every woman, every woman truly does not want a good man, and they don't know they don't have a good man until they realize they lost him already. Let me just say this: if you're in a position to where you know you 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 knew this girl, you made your move, and then she said, ah, "You're you're really not my type," or she says, "I I really appreciate it, but you're too nice." Ooh, you're too nice, and. When you are that guy that's really nice, it's not just because I'm not it's not because like you're beta or you you are you know you're just a gentleman, but it, in most cases it's because you really have it all together. You actually have yourself together, you have a good job or you have a good business that's going on. You have your own place. Not only does you have your own place, but you got a good car. Let me just say this real quick. A lot of women out there don't really want a good man. Why? Because there's really nothing for him to act. There's not really nothing for her to... She, she, basically, what women like to find is chaos. They want chaos, and they want to cause more chaos. They want to have their cake and eat it, too. And here's another thing is that when a good man knows himself, he has peace, and he has quietness, there's a lot of women out there that just want to bring noise, loudness, everything that disturbs your peace. And honestly, they really don't deserve a good man. And a lot of you already have been already in relationships to where you are the good guy. You are really a good guy. But your relationship didn't go out well because she actually doesn't deserve a good guy like you. And because you are treading upward to being a better man every single day when you're focused on being a better person every single day, be better than yesterday, she really didn't deserve you. She don't deserve you. Not all women deserve a good man because guess what? A good man will hold his woman accountable for her behavior, for her emotions, for her decisions. He will hold her accountable. And a lot of women don't like being held accountable because they like chaos so anytime that you find yourself in a position to where you know you're hollering at this girl and the next thing you know she's just she feels like she can have her cake and eat it too and stuff like that let it be known that you cannot be treated that way and that you will not be treated that way because guess what you're going to walk away and you should walk away why because there's going to be someone else better anyway Someone that will actually value your time, actually appreciate you, your presence, and not just treat you like a rat and treat you like some scrub. And they actually will support you and help you with your vision, making it a reality. They will help you with your, they, they will not only help you with your inner peace, but they'll go on this journey with you on wherever your goals are. And they'll help you with your guidance because at the end of the day, it can be a lonely world sometimes, especially when you're if you're also an entrepreneur out there. Shout out to all my entrepreneurs that are striving for that dream. But understand that when you are treading upward, you have to know that there's not going to be that many good girls. You're not going to find a nice girl. You're not going to find a good girl. The more successful you become, you're going to find all those women that do want chaos and destruction. You're going to find all those women that want to take you off your balance and take you, uh, and, and, and take you from quietness to loudness. 
the more successful you become, it will be really hard to find a good girl. And even where you are right now, because your relationship didn't go the way it went, your old relationship didn't go the way it went, it's because you two have different visions. She probably has a different vision to where it has nothing to do with you. It just has no value to you. And you have a different vision to where you want greatness for you. But you have to understand that that person that you were with, she lost a good man. She lost a good man and she ain't going to find another good man like you. Why? Because you're, you're a diamond in the rough. You're a diamond in the rough that honestly, it is a lottery prize. It is you're, you're, you got to understand that you're worth more than the lottery prizes out there in the world. So whenever you find yourself, you know, asking the question, why can't I find, why, 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 why does she want me if I'm all these great qualities? It's because you are those great, great qualities and she actually thinks she don't deserve you. She actually did you a favor. She actually made, she actually helped you move on. But for you, you can't be dwelling on the fact that she didn't want you. You can't be dwelling on the fact that, you know, it's in the past. Obviously, it's in the past. You can't be dwelling on the past. Because if you dwell on the past, your present is not going to look good. And your future is not going to look good because you're dwelling on the past. So, understand that there's a lot of, you know, a lot of women don't deserve a good man. Because a good man knows where he's going. He's quiet. He's got peace. He has everything together. And she doesn't deserve that. And she doesn't want to be held accountable because a good man will hold his woman accountable. Just as much he would expect her to hold him accountable. Because at the end of the day, when it comes to being in a relationship, it's not individual, individual it becomes one. It's a team. And, not, and, and here's another thing. A lot of women are not good team players. So that's pretty much my whole thing. So if you're someone that's wanting to get over your ex, you can get my book called 10 Simple Tips to Get Over Your Ex. And of course, if you like my videos, you can donate using PayPal and Venmo. I... Uh, information in the description box of course and if you want my one-on-one uh, -on -one coaching of course it is black november and i am offering free one-on-one -on -one coaching with your man's mr dominic cruz but if you find this information valuable i want you to drop a like drop a comment and drop a share and of course it is your man's mr dominic cruz let me know what you guys think in the description box at the in, in, in the description box in the comments and know what your thoughts on this whole thing is and of course it is your man's mr dominic cruz coming at you with another video yes another one another one another one another one until next time ladies and gentlemen take it easy